So then we got to uh, Trinidad near Eureka and uh, got to our campsite, Wiffle Ball. And then, um, because someone else can tell that story. And uh, (laughs) people responsible can tell that story. Before we got to the campsite, we went to a rest stop and I bought one of those Wiffle Bat Ball toy combinations that come because I wanted to play Wiffle Ball. (laughs) And when we got to the campsite, we, uh... Everyone's trying to set up, but I was like so eager to play with a ball that like <laughs> I tossed the ball to to Debbie. I was like, Debbie, throw the ball. He threw the ball at me. He's like, pitch it. I'm like, Christian, if you play this right now, you're gonna lose it. He's like, that'll nah, be fine. I'll be fine. And I'm like, okay. And the first pitch, Debbie hit me in the shoulder, and it was a very kind of hard wiffle ball. I was like, ow, that actually kind of hurt. He seems to complain about that a lot, but come on, bro, it was a. <laughs> A wiffle ball <laughs> that did not hurt and i'm not a good pitcher clearly i guess it kind of like riled me up and i was like all right i'm gonna show you <laughs> he throws it back at me he's like yeah throws it back at me he's like do it again i'm like okay and the next pitch debbie and i pitched and i hit it and it went it's gone i'm like what i say <laughs> and I go, are you going to go look for it? He's like, yeah. And so he, he goes, he ventures in the back of the campground for a little bit. As far as I know, it's probably never going to move. It's just going to be there for all the time. Because <laughs> I went to look for it and I didn't find it. So <laughs> it's gone. Uh, so there goes that with all story. Literally, that's all it was. It was in my life for like 17 minutes. 